keeps us warm We can spend the night Underneath the mistletoe And I've gotten you a present Good morning guys, welcome to today. It's Wednesday, lesson day, and it snowed today. And it's still snowing right now. Today is Wednesday. Today's Wednesday, dogs are having fun in the snow. They haven't seen it for at least six months. <laughs> we'll see how the horses are. It's gonna be Penny's first time in the snow. And the big horses are gonna go out here again. They might have some fun. And I have to check on my toboggan. It might be full of snow. Hey, Chino. How's it going? Hey, Chino, I'll get your food. Yeah, so I know. You want to go out in the snow too and play? First, have your breakfast. Okay, have your breakfast. Hi, huh, Penny. Oh, you got snow on you already. You're wet. You're wet. Get in your spots. Penny's in her spot. Penny's in her spot. Good job, Penny. There you go, man. There you go. There you go. Okay, Willow. Get in your spot. Can't be too close to Penny. There you, there you go. There you go, Willow. Okay, Gracie. Come over here, Grace. There you go, Gracie. There we go. Wintry paddock. Paddock and the wind's coming in this way, and this is what I think I need to get some snow fencing and put it along there. And I'm going to do that, just haven't uh, had time to do it yet. So I'm going to get some snow fencing that'll block the wind and they'll block this. It gets really snowy here with the snow drift. So if I put some snow fencing there, I won't get as much snow drifts. Time in the snow. What's she gonna do? What's she gonna do in the snow? Hey, honey, do you like the snow? Just testing it out to see if it tastes good. <laughs> Smelling it. Oh, got hay in her eye. All right, Penny's first time in the snow. You should take her out there and walk her a bit and see if she likes running in it. I don't know. trying to figure out where's the grass where's the hay it's all missing oh there's some grass oh and there it goes digging away and eating No reaction to this baby. She's smelling. <laughs> she doesn't care. <laughs> doesn't care about nothing. She's really calm, eh? She doesn't... When she gets older, she'll be running out there and jumping, I bet. We perfect for this week. Tomorrow it is Christmas. The first for you. This is actually the not the first time, but like the first time in a long while boys home and this is why I think I need to get a bucket and put the hay in because I can see that hay going to waste in the snow pretty quick. All right, we're ready to go. Ready to go. Gina's going out. I don't know if Penny needs a blanket. It's not that cold for a blanket yet but Gino has no Winter hair. He's a weird. Oh, you all right, Ben? He's a weird horse. He doesn't get that much hair, and he gets cold easy. Oh, Willow needs a blanket. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Just wait.
Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. Man, you don't realize what you need to do when, when it snows. I mean, I should, I should have made, I wasn't thinking about that. We're going to try and put Gino out with the girls in the winter area for a bit, but it didn't happen. And now I think I need to make a box for that because if I make a box and have some insulated things in it, that box of water won't freeze as much and the snow wouldn't be on it. And I'm thinking the shelter there, I don't even know why we have it so far. We have it at the end of the field, way down there. It may, it may have been better just to have it right in the beginning of the field. morning guys welcome to today's video today I have brown hair brownish blonde hair brown hair <laughs> dyed my hair last night it was the only dye I had Sam bought it for me one day and it was the wrong color so I haven't used it and I wanted to dye my hair it was the only one I had so I used it I'm not sure that I really like it but I'm not sure that I really hate it hair is just hair it doesn't bother me it'll go back once I wash it like twice it'll be blonde again I love you little baby we love you, little baby. <laughs> she does have sassy moments. She's like, do that more. More, Mom. More. Keep going. Keep going. <laughs> she loves to be scratched. Oh, that's the spot. That's the spot. <laughs> Anyway, I'll welcome to today and welcome to a brown hair day. We're headed out to find the sled because it snowed. And I saw it snowed. I hate snow. <laughs> hate it. I hate it with my whole soul. This is not my favorite thing. And it's still even, it's still snowing even actually. Open the door just now to come down to the barn. And the only dog that came with us was Molly. <laughs> Ruby. Oh, is Ruby here? Oh, oftentimes Ruby doesn't come out in the afternoon. She's like, eh, I'm done. Ollie comes around here. Yeah, Ollie's been here. You can see He's Ollie. Going that way. Kitty footprints. Where is it? It's right here. Oh, somehow the sled. Oh, how did you find that? It's a little goofy. Somehow our sled got over here. Sam said that we left it here. There's no way we left it here. I say it blew here. A big giant. Spider web there. Ooh. How fun. Give me the sled! It definitely blew over here. Definitely blew over here. Pull! Alright. Shake that sucker off and you can sled. Sophie's been here, outside. Like this, I'll sit on it and you drag me. No, there's no way I can drag you. Sophie thought that she was... Oh, let's go to the sledding hill your dad made. Yeah. Alright, well, let's go do that. I actually wanted to work with my horse, but yeah, we'll do that instead. Sophie well, we thought that it would be a snow day today, and then she remembered. Well, and then I explained to her it's a home well, I school. Know there was school, but I like spending time in snow. Yeah, she knew there was school, but she was hoping she'd get to spend time in the snow. Oh, I and did. Spend she time did in spend snow. time in the snow. That's the best part about home school. Yeah, she went outside when it was chore time, and she played and played, and she came in ready for school. Yep, yeah, it's just Molly out here. <laughs> so this is our sledding hill. There's not a lot of. Um, snow on it and it doesn't even drop very well. I don't think this is going to work. This is not a good sledding hill. Today we're taking Chino in for lessons and we're going to try and take Gracie too. We took Gracie once before, got her used to the whole place. We're going to take her back today and just put her in a lesson and see how it goes. I was talking about it with Brandon. I'm like, I'm nervous and he's like, just put her in and we'll see how it goes. Making our Christmas memories I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep Speaking of our spook challenge <laughs> Chino often stands in that field and watches us to see when there's scary things Can, can I go again? And he, yeah, go ahead And he does get scared when like there are things like sleds that he doesn't know. Definitely noticed the sled. 
or he wants to go in, but I'm pretty sure he noticed the sled. Yeah, I spend my time running around, keeping people pleased. But this is my favorite holiday. It's a chance to start over new. Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but you. These are the good times with you. Baby, this year is just gonna be you and me. Hang by the fire and chill. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Making our Christmas memories. Oh, and I've been longing to hold you close. Forget about everyone else. Isn't this how it's supposed to be? Somebody, nobody gave Gabby the memo that it snowed. She's wearing running shoes. She says that the snow will probably be gone tomorrow. Follow Gabby in. Don't follow Gabby's footsteps, guys. They are vans. They are vans. What does that mean? They're not running shoes. Oh, they're not running shoes. They're vans. Tino's like, are you coming for me? Come on, tell the truth. Are you coming for me? <laughs> He's like, I need to go in. <laughs> he sees the sled. He's like, help! Making our Christmas memories. Oh oh. La da da da. Oh oh. La da da da. Oh oh. La da da da. Making our Christmas memories. I've been wrapping presents for you. I've been hanging marbles in the tree. And I've lit my house with Christmas lights. So you should come back home to me. There is nothing I like about winter. Nothing about it. And I don't know why Penny rolls her head in the mud so that she gets it all in her ears. And then when I have to get it out of her ears, she's like, come touch my ears. She doesn't, whoa. She doesn't mind if I try and get it out of her ears as long as I don't touch inside her ears. Which she does let me, but not enough to get that out. Anyway, nothing I like about winter. Taking care of horses in winter is horrible. I'm gonna try and pick her feet right now and my hands are gonna freeze and she's gonna be wet and it's gonna be awful. You guys know how Penny has eyelids that turn under and in the summer and in the spring and in the fall, mostly in the fall and summer, I, I get your butt in there. I like to wash her face and her bum when I groom her with like warm water and yeah you can't do that in the winter anyways so come on over here penny pickle so you guys know that i've been struggling with penny recently to load her on the trailer and i'm like penny we worked so hard we worked so hard and now she's giving me problems i know that what's happening is that she's basically saying like you're not the boss of me i don't really have to do it unless i want to do it and then i work at it and work at it and work at it with her to get her on the trailer and then when she gets tired of it it's like a game and when she gets tired of it she's like fine and she just hops on like she's not scared she's not she's not like she knows what to do it's that she doesn't think she has to do what i say so i've been dying to work with her and do some things that i know will help but, as is the life of a mom and a YouTuber, you never have time. So uh, today I'm going to try and do some like sending exercises. I worked on it before with her last winter and didn't really get very far. Um, but I'm super excited about it and about getting her listening. I just don't know if this will work. So. Basically, I'm hoping to get some sending exercises done with Penny before the kids make their way from sledding down to the barn.
yesterday we did the last to spook challenge and both of my kids thought that it was like a challenge challenge where they had to like win it and I didn't clarify that it wasn't about scaring the horses it was about seeing which of our horses was the least spooky so Gracie yeah Gracie won like no. so I win so yeah what both Palominos won I think Palominos are not spooky horses like you know how grays they say are like super spooky anyways so yesterday when we did that challenge if you didn't see it we posted it yesterday anyways Sophie came out and went running with the the with a tarp and we tried to desensitize them to it a little bit after she did that because it actually just scared them it wasn't productive in any way shape or form so today I'm going to do a little bit more with the horses so that um with the tarp so that I know for sure that they're not scared of it because we plan to do a lot of stuff with our horses and tarps I don't want them scared of it so also my sending exercises weren't perfect I hope to be able to do them every single time I'm at the barn <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if Penny will eat snow. <laughs> you can throw it at Pino. He doesn't You want a bite? She's like, I had enough snow. Oh, she's scared of it. I threw a snowball at you. You're know? okay. Let Gracie have a bite. He blanket and he didn't care. Only Minis want it. What? Snowball, like, you know, <laughs> blanket. He didn't care. He was watching the sled. I have a friend that her dad was throwing snowballs at a goat, just playing, not like throwing them at him to hurt them, just throwing them in the air, and the goats were like enjoying it. And the horse, the, her, their daughter got into a really bad accident on the horse and spent a long time in the hospital. <sighs> Gotta be careful. Yeah. I'm also in the process of making my first aid kit video i'm still i've been collecting a bunch of stuff and i've been trying to put all of the stuff that we already have in one area so that i can make a video i'm just behind you guys <laughs> i'm behind Stop. are you using my horse to chase your sister no what is your new trick wow i love it all i have to do is just tap the clock wow do you guys see that come a little closer and do it There's a bit of a competition going on. Whenever Sophie goes to work with Willow, Honey's like, I want to work. I want to be with you. I want to do it. had that uh that Laura Laura and Penny times when it was just her and I and Irina. Yeah. I think that could become a thing again. Walk Willow. <laughs> and Willow just wants. <laughs> Willow's obviously not scared of it either. She just doesn't understand. She thinks that she's supposed to be performing a trick. Happens when you have two minis. <laughs> she doesn't really care about the tarp, she just wants to do a fist bump to get a treat. For the most part, I think our horses don't really care. They're used to whatever we throw at them, literally. <laughs> but I definitely wanted to make sure that, especially Willow, wasn't scared of the tarp and then. Also, Penny, Gracie's not scared of it. Yeah, Honey has never been scared of anything yet. I really enjoy doing groundwork. It's really complicated to, to film and do it because setting up the camera every five seconds and then also like trying to figure out the camera and doing what I want to do. 
makes it difficult, makes it harder for me to like practice and perfect it because I'm always worried about like where the camera's gonna go and stuff. But I really like sharing me learning. And I know it's not much, just simple groundwork, but I think like everybody thinks groundwork is so basic, but for me, it's everything. I don't you know that you're beautiful Just the way you are Just the way you came Don't you know that you're beautiful Don't you know that you're